Setting things off, Larry gonna get grabbed, but drops down with the Nair, can immediately answer with the Rapid Jab, forcing him back to the left-hand side. Oh, Perry's off the fair, too? That yeah, tilt leads to big damage and straight to 67%. Back here is going to force him off stage, too. I don't know if he has a jump. Oh, my God. So quick with all that damage. And now he's trying to come in quick on the ledge. Comes in aggressive and gets himself in there. Yeah, able to find his footing back down now. Larry just trying to find his way back in. Getting by the down tilt. Get an up tilt to back here, and that's going to take the first stock. All right, great stuff right there from Louis Money. And you don't really see Doc doing anything out here, but Louis, man. It's pretty much just Louis who's yeah. actually been carrying this character for the most part, showing everybody that down tilt to down beat so good at the ledge. Trying to go for it right there, but Larry able to get out of it. Yeah, kind of trapping him right here, though. Oh, great side B. Perfect timing. Actually going to clank with that back air and do nothing. Yeah, Larry's already prepared for that roll on as well. Big damage because of it going straight to 70%. But trying Ooh. to go for the dare before he can recover, but he's going to get by. Yeah, he was so close with that man, and now it's Doc's turn to have this edge guard situation. Going to have to upbeat to the ledge and dodge that dash attack. Great aerial right there to come on. Yeah, Rising Fair going to give him stage positioning yet again. Forces him back to left-hand side. You see Louis trying to reset, but he's going to get up tilted yet again. That move is such a good anti-air, and he hasn't really been able to have an answer for Larry so far at the beginning of this match. Right, and both of them just trading, coming in really aggressively when they get onto the stage. Once they pick up on that, man, it's going to be all over. Mm -hmm. It seems Louis starting to catch on a little bit of Larry's tendencies, but the tech's going to get him by. Yeah, really good. And you saw that mix up on the recovery this time. A good down here, though, is going to take the first stock off the uh, left side. Yeah, throwing out the uh, down B Cyclone on the way back down. Get to push him off. But again, actually, it doesn't even matter. Up tilt to back here yet again is going to take another stock. Larry cruising right now. Yeah, that barely actually took the stock there. Looked like he was going to live for just a second, but uh, not quite. Down, down an entire stock right now. Scary situation to be in. Yeah, if he can start to rack on some damage, but he's been getting called out repeatedly every time he goes airborne yeah. by these up tilts. He's got to find an answer to that. Oh, and these backers, though, kind of racking him up to 70 and trapped on the ledge, too. Ooh, quickly getting over, just jumping over top of Louis. Yeah, you already see Larry is content with just playing nice and slow by the ledge. He's not overcommitting off stage, yeah. giving up stage positioning. Very important thing to do here, especially when you're in the lead. And thank you, Dorian INC, for the donation. Thank for you charity. for every donation. We want to get ourselves up to 5,000 before the end of this pool. You know we can do it. Oh, for sure. All right, great up tilt right there. Going to come in with another, or with a fair landing. Yeah, he was looking to see what his reaction would be right there. That down tilt had a lot of range. Gonna force him back at the ledge yet again. Great down tilt once again. And he's trapped right now. How's he gonna get up? Oh, up B so early because of the laser sort of messed up the way he wanted well. to get there. He's not gonna be able to get back. He's gonna get caught by the fair and Larry's gonna take game one. Yeah, he had the directional air dodge in that situation because like you said, he took his jump away uh, with that laser and uh, unfortunate spot. Yeah, one of the strengths of Dr. Mario being able to kill so early, but also the fact that he's not going to be able to make it back as consistently. You saw Larry again. It's like, all right, if I just catch you in one of these jumps, if uh -huh. I keep forcing you off stage, eventually you're going to be stuck in a situation where I can finally commit. And there it was, for sure. Mm -hmm. So game two looks like, what did they just pick? Was that Smashville or Battlefield? Uh, I saw they were on the left side of the screen, but not were, if they were up or down. You were at least paying attention because I looked away. <laughs> all right, we're going to see the Fox coming in. Uh, I actually agree with this. You know, it, uh, Dr. Mario seemed like a comfort pick for the most part in that mm -hmm. matchup, but opting to go with the Fox now. Yeah, definitely another character that he's really comfortable with. Uh, and you love to see the spacey ditto, man. Oh, get good force, touch Get a force that's a ledge. Now, this is, yet again, another matchup that Larry is not only extremely comfortable with. Gonna catch him with the dare. Is he gonna make that back? He's not. Larry no. taking the first knock rather swift. Yeah, it knocked him down so low, and he was in hit stun for just a little bit too long. Unable to get his B special out before he was uh, gonna go down into the glass zone. When you play a character for so long, you know how to abuse it. But also, yes. Louis kind of answering pretty easy to just not gonna get the up smash he was looking for there. Larry immediately attacking the M stuff out of that. Right, and I love that fade back right there. And to go into an aerial quick. Chase him on these platforms right now, kind of sharking him. Mm -hmm. You see, like Larry's committed to the same plan as before. But he's going a little bit aggressive on landing now. Seems like Louis caught on to it. Right. And now trapped on the right side. Gotta be careful. He probably was gonna jump onto the stage, but he showed his hand a little bit too early with that forward smash. Mm -hmm. And he was just like, never mind. Yeah, just play around the ledge. Like, I am not going anywhere near those. <laughs> yeah, man, that's all yours. All right, forward airing him off the right side, and that laser once again. One to the side, be right in his face. Whoa! He set that whole situation up as soon as he had tilted him back off. He had no jump. He had to go a specific way. Right. Larry already prepared for it. Yeah, he up he just a little too close to him and allowed that whole situation to happen. Down there, Spike. And again, he's just been trying to reset, trying to get himself back down on the ground, but Larry's been abusing him accordingly for it. Yeah, look at these platforms, man. Battlefield clearly not the pick to go to. Yeah, I like the idea behind it on paper, but at the same time, look at how fast this has been going. This is... They're making this matchup look extremely well done. Ooh. Try to go for a Ooh, side B to get the spike. Okay, did he go for a side B? But it doesn't matter. Gonna get knocked off the left side here. And Louis Money slowly trying to bring this back, man. 
Yeah, Louis, if he can start to slow down the match, he has to play very careful. But holding shield there seems like Larry is cross conditioned multiple games. He hasn't really gone for too many grabs. Now that he's got the established pressure, he's going for it. And that was a great uh, hesitation right there, using the shine to slow himself down so he didn't get back to the stage exactly where Larry Lur thought he'd be. Yeah, especially with the fact that he's caught him on multiple dares now, you better start changing up that timing. Exactly, and the side beat just to get over there quicker, okay? Yeah, you see, that time he actually faded back, throwing out the near to avoid the up tilt. He's actually starting to slowly bring this back, going yeah. for a shine attempt. Ooh, and almost with the forward smash follow up right there, too. And here's a dash attack. Wants to catch him on the platform. A good patience on Larry, not pulling the trigger too early there. He could have been caught while he was jumping. Granted, up air does not kill nearly as early in this game. Ooh. But the up smash is going to be a punish on the up smash as well. Going to yeah. take him out. That's definitely something you see from a lot of Foxes where they're like, all right, I need to close this out. I'm going to come in for the up smash. They won't see it coming. But Larry, he plays Fox himself. He knows that trick. He invented that trick. So unfortunately, not going to work on him. Yeah, Larry even uh, playing all of the spaces going into this next game here, kind of establishing a multi-character uh, specialist role. And I like the idea behind it because rather than playing up the ditto, he's been able to establish something that maybe Louis is not prepared for. Yeah. Like outside of, like there's not many Falco representatives. There's Koki out in the Tri-State area. There's Larry. And I can't really... I think Kitaro has dropped the character by now, so sad days. Yeah, Kitaro has a very solid snake. I, bet. I, I keep doing that all day. I'm not intentionally making that pun. But. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, but anyway, Larry Lur and Louie Money going into this game through situation. Didn't see the stage, but we're going to find out in just a second here. And Running of it back with the Fox, Fox. it yeah. definitely was a lot better than the, the Dr. Mario, that's for sure. Yeah, especially on that last stock that he had. He pulled out so much power suddenly. Mm -hmm. I like the fact that they decided to go to PS2 as well, being able to have more situations where he can reset the match and back off after the pressure that uh, Larry kept establishing. Yeah, Larry, you, look, I just want to back off and get things going my way. And you do not want to give him triplats after the way that he abused them against you in the last game. But all right, we got a throw combo starting up right now. A couple of aerials. Oh, great parry into that up tilt. Dash tag, dash tag. Oh, there we go. All of a sudden started to cook it up, but he actually aimed for the wrong way. Yeah, he thought he had the read on the left side of the platform, but he wound up on the right and, yeah, unfortunately not able to get the punish in time. You see Larry actually throw out that down tilt there to bait out the jump and actually catch him with the up tilt, but he was able to push him on the other side. Okay, and he's trapped here. Oh, a ledge Ooh. throw! You honestly yeah. don't see that too much anymore in yeah, this game. Yeah, it's not last as strong. Game, it was, game. It, yeah. it was It was a much better option than the last game, but it's still a nice little thing to hold on cross games. Like, all right, they don't expect this. They're not going to exactly. respect this option. Got to hold on to every trick in the book, man. And Larry, Larry or uh, Louie Money actually able to capitalize right there. Ooh. First lead of the set. You see Louis starting to like fade back a little bit. He's recognizing he's trying to go for the callouts, but the up tilt to up air is not going to take it just yet. That had the sparks on it, man. That looks scary. A great down air right there, too. Oh, Can we get a buff to when sparks actually go off, like they kill? <laughs> right. Like it's just cinematic. Stop messing with our heads. All right, he's throwing him off the right side here. Oh, try to get a fair, but not going to be able to time it perfectly. Side B, so risky. Yeah, and he's going to pay for it heavily yeah, with the stock. Opting to go for the illusion just to try and get himself some type of reset position, but Larry is already in position before. It's like, you know what? I'm not going to move. I'm perfectly fine at where exactly. my clock is. All right, this man's moving around on the platform so clean, avoiding the laser, and then just starting up this combo right here. Yeah, if you miss those techs, that's a lot of damage. And you see, actually, Louis, I, I think this stage is working out much better for him. It yes. removed that whole fact that he was getting juggled endlessly. Yeah, that was mainly the problem, is that he could not land for the entire time. He was getting edge guarded hard, but now turning the situation around with that ledge trump uh, holding on to the momentum here. Yeah, see, even right there, the fact that he decided to back off, it's like, all right, look, Larry is looking for this answer. We're looking for more. Uh, Esam won the bet. That is coming in from Vicious, <laughs> who uh, is watching all of the Street Fighter boys lose all the side events. Thank you so much for the $40 donation for charity and that combo right there. Thank you so much for that up smash. Knocking that man against the screen. Going to take a second stock. Blessed by the Book of Fox. When in doubt, run up up smash. I'm saying, man. <laughs> all right, he's going to throw him up there. Not able to get much sharking out of those platforms right there, but still moving fine. Yeah, and it seems like he's starting to play around a little bit of what Larry's mix up have been. Like, he actually decided to go for a tomahawk there. He has it really all set. Right. Ooh. Oh, cool boy. Thank you so much for the $1. You are truly cool. Thank you for the donations. Every single bit counts towards these charity events. We greatly appreciate that. My man kind of moving around at the ledge right here, looking really trapped, almost catching the forward air right here. Larry, man, try, trailing from behind this entire game. Yeah, Fair is such a great option on the illusion, but louis has been able to get by. And you see Louis taking the patient route now. It's like, why am I going to commit? I have a stock up. You have to come to me. Absolutely. And Larry's landing with a lot of aerials, man. He is definitely making a pay for it with these parry punishes. Ooh. Yeah, I think if we uh, if we see yet another game, we probably will not be seeing this long stage, but he's going to catch the illusion. This could potentially be the last stop of this match. Yeah, and that's honestly, the, that's very scary that he keeps going for those illusions. That's the only way he's lost his stocks this game. He's got to be careful with that and almost catching him, though. Just up barely smash. not getting that up smash. I don't know if it would have killed on that position, but it was on the platform side. That could have worked out. Right. 
All right, try both of them just playing it safe, man. You see moving money, yeah, just yeah. escaping across the stage. It's like, you know what, if I keep getting small hits, uh, you're going to be that much closer to, to kill percent for me. Yeah, oh, great spike Oh, he right missed there. a tech, missed two techs, oh, and this is God. big damage. Scary spot to be in right now. He was up by so much, and suddenly it's completely even. My man trying to play it safe. He's looking for that Nair landing, and he found it, but did not get the up smash punish. Went for the tech chase, but didn't go far enough, and all of a sudden... Side I can't believe he keeps throwing that out! It does occasionally co combo into an up air, but at that window it didn't work, and the up tilt up air also not going to work. Good DI from Louis. But he's going to finally get hit on the illusion from that Off fair. That's going to be a 3 0. Again. Wow, great stuff right there from Larry Lur. Just uh, literally catching every single illusion and making him pay for it. Louis Money was up by quite a bit, but unfortunately couldn't hold on to that. Um, yeah, just off the illusions. Yeah, you see a lot of times people get really stressed when they're buried in the corner. It's like, I gotta reset my positioning.